know what you're talking about. Oh, okay. So now you don't know. Marte said you know everything. We got Marte Grant. That's whoever he is to you. He gave us all the information said that you knew that it was going on, that it was drug trafficking going on. We have him right here. Would you like to speak to him? Yep. All right, one moment. She's asking for a request to speak to y'all. I'll tell you if you can get him over and switch it over. He's in there. You can bring him in there. So we step out. We're going to let you talk to him. There you go. She's asking to speak to you. We'll go. This is funny, Marco. Nana. What? Nana. What? I'm in here right now. These people... Just um, uh, between us. Where are you at? I'm in Atlanta right now, but they talking about expediting me to Kansas City. For what? Everything that he done said so far. For drugs? Nah, no, that's it's besides the point. But the thing is, is that they 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 recorded me right now, but I don't know. I don't know what they're talking about because you'd be the last person. Nana, that I know. Have drugs Nana, I know. Nana, I know. But I mean, they. Just... Nana, you don't know nothing. Remember, you don't. I remember you don't know nothing. I know. What's the matter with you? No, I'm, I'm good. I'm just trying to stay up right now. Why? What you, Nana, I'm. They have me locked up right now. What? Nana, um, I'll be you back. You locked up for what? Really? Nana, it's, it's okay. What? It's okay, Nana. Oh, no. Why are you crying? I'm good. I'm not crying. Hello? Yeah. Nah, nah, they about to come nah, back here. No, we're not. We're back. So, if you don't mind speaking to us, uh, when was the last time you talked to Marte Grant? Marte Grant? I don't know Marte Grant. Marte Grant? Yeah. Marte Gant. And what, what are those drugs, ma'am? Uh, you have made my hip a lot. Man, what was it? Me, what? Hip, you're not getting no information. Ma'am. Anyway. Ma'am, when was the last time you took what, a... Put, what, 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 what's your number and your, your phone number and badge number? Because I got to have that first before I talk to you. Ma'am, can you, can you calm down? Because you keep saying it's a prank and nothing here is funny. Listen here, you job turkey. None of this is funny, okay? You're not funny. None of this is funny. <laughs> Y'all are some job turkeys to try to prank the nana. The nana on prankable. Tell that back. Yeah, kiss my <laughs> right. We don't listen to no BS. All right. We got it. Right. All right, that's what we're doing. Let me just media on that how you doing today, sir? Hey, how's, how's it going, man? What's your call? Um, name's Black. Black Attack, they called me. But hey, so we're looking Black. to do a production, and I see you here on Craigslist. You have an ad for it. A- yeah, actually, yeah. We, uh, what kind of production are you doing? We, we handle, uh, I mean, everything from, you know, music videos, commercials. Okay, you know, say, look, say look. Say look. Say right. look. Check this out. This is All between right, me and you. Him. Okay. It's what between is, me and him. Like, what's this production team called and where they located? Uh, we are, uh, he said, with my team called, we're, we're Rob Rodriguez, Rodriguez Bros Media, we're out of New York and L.A., um, but, you know, we also have uh, crews in Atlanta and South Stages and things of that nature. Yeah, yeah, cut the shit. Check this out. Okay. I got a project for you. High dollar, high dollar, but you got to tell me if you're with me or not, and you got to tell me early. Well, what kind of budget do you have, and what is it? Budget's out of the matter. I got money. I got money to blow. But it's about if you're going to do the project or not, pal. Why do you seem like you got like an attitude or something? We're just trying to figure out. Like We just have a project that we're working on and feel like you're just coming on us with an attitude. 
Well, you know, I get these kind of calls five times a day. And, you know, I'm trying to give you all the benefit of that. I mean, I'm trying to act like I'm going to attitude. Okay, cut the shit. Uh, cut the shit. My guy over here, he's trying to be, he's trying to keep it cool. My guy over here is trying to keep it fucking cool. But check this out. You know, okay, go ahead, man. you know, we're, I'm going to give you an opportunity. You know, opportunity of a fucking Shoot. lifetime. Shoot. All right, check this out. So, so this is just between us, and uh, you you keep it cut it straight to me. Hold on. What are you, like? What are you doing right now? Uh, about to actually pull out of the studio in LA. Just finished the uh, shoot for uh, one of the soccer teams here. Okay, can you stay on topic? We trying to talk about like projects. He, this guy's this guy's all over the place. Any what are you talking about? No, why'd you get off topic? You just asked me what I was doing right now, and I answered it. We never asked what you were doing. We talking about we're trying to hire you for a project. Yo, this kid's crazy. So we're trying to hire you for a project. And what's the company called again? Rodriguez Bros Media. You can look this up on the website, www.rodriguezbrosmedia.com. Sorry, but, uh, cut the shit. Hey, 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 guys, can you just get to the point? Really, like, I mean, what's going on here? Oh, so you want us to cut the shit. Do you know who my daddy is? Man, I don't care who your daddy is. To be honest with you, man. Who, what's your daddy name? What's your daddy name? That don't, that, that doesn't mean... No, no, what's your daddy name? My daddy name is Jesus. How about that? He ain't got the no daddy. Almighty. He ain't got no daddy. Okay, so basically what we got going on is kind of like hamster. Give it to him raw. It's like hamster porn. Give it to him raw. He said, what? It's hamster... Hamsters, like hamster dating. So basically where we step into the world of hamsters and we get their thoughts and the day by day that they live and how does it feel to get picked See, up. look, this guy's over here sugarcoating it. We want you to record hamsters. Man, if y'all don't get off my phone, man. Have you ever done that yeah, before? Wait, let, me, I, let me ask you a question. Do y'all get off on that kind of stuff? Or what, the f what the For real? Yeah, I mean, I'm Who's y'all? No, basically, it's, it's hamster dating world. So, basically, I, listen, listen, listen. It's not that, listen, it's not his saying the wrong thing. thing. We're trying to put money in his pocket. So, basically, we go in the world of hamsters, how they survive, like, you know, where they come from, and interview hamsters. So, we're just trying to find a great camera crew, and we send your ad, and we want to hire you, and it's basically the day of life. Right. I think y'all got the wrong company, and listen, and first of all, are you Dr. Doolittle? How the hell are you going to talk to a hamster? I'm not even going to lie to you. Y'all need to get off my phone. Yeah, How much you want? Time. How much you want? L name a I price. Listen, I don't want nothing from y'all. Y'all a bunch of sickos. Y'all fucking weird. Don't How knock we it until you try it. Don't worry. Look, like, basically, we're trying to figure out the the inside and out of hamsters. And that's just all it is because a lot of people want to know what's going on with them. So I don't understand why you're discriminating against us because it's, it's a mindset thing. And your mind is totally like, mm. have to get with it, you know? You have to slow down. Yeah. So first of all, first of all, we're gonna call. Okay, we're gonna call you back because I don't like you. Like you getting rude with us. Like we was trying to get like. Hey, please lose my number. Don't call me back. What about your car? Your car there? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say we come pick it up. All right, so you two right now we about to call. My grandma, my nana, my nana, 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 nana. So basically, she's in Kansas City, Missouri. We about to, I'm going to call and be the tow truck driver. And we coming to pick up the car. Mm -hmm. And we got to get that car to drop. Okay. President. All right. Hello? 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 How you doing? Uh, we're calling about the what? Uh, we're a tow company. We're coming to calling about what is it again? What kind of car is it? It's Cadillac, goddamn it! We're getting, calling about the Cadillac. We're gonna come pick it up. We're calling what? We're calling about the Cadillac. We're coming to repo. We're gonna pick up the Cadillac. I'm going over a few paperwork right here. We're calling you. See, do you do you need anything out of the Cadillac? Okay, so can you remove it? We're going to come and pick it up. Where? Uh, probably about like five minutes. What's car, what else car is in the driveway? It's in, it's in the back. What kind of car do you Hold got? On Hold on just a minute. Hold on, hello, ma'am. Hello? Mia? 
ma'am. Yes. We don't. We don't. We need to talk to you, okay? Because this is something that's going on. Basically, we're going to have. Uh, are we allowed to come in the house as well to speak to you? Is that right? They found drugs in the car. All right. Yeah, so basically it's basically it's it's under police investigation that it was drugs inside the car outside your house. So do you know anything about that? Who is this? This is Officer De Officer Chris. Officer what? This is Officer Chris and with the tow company as well. We're at tow now. So basically we're calling we basically we got Marte. Marte had went down basically in Atlanta with drug trafficking. So and we're told that it's drugs inside the car that's been going in and out. So basically it's under an investigation. So you gonna come in here from Atlanta? No, we have officers down there. We have all we're on three way right here. We have the tow lot on the on the three way and we're here we're also here. This is Officer Curtis and he also got Danley on the phone. Officer Hello. Howdy. Hey, who's this? The name's Jamal. I think believe I got your contact um, earlier this week in regards to production. Production? Yes, sir. Is this not right. in, in hell, in jail, I believe? In jail? In hell? Um, in hell production? I believe so. That I, I thought I got your number from you. Does it, uh, does it have to do with music or what? What kind of production? So it was a music. Um, it was you and another fella, a fella with um, I believe dreads. But we all spoke um uh, not too long ago, I believe, and it was in regards to music. I believe you were doing the music part, and he was doing the uh, video part. Correct? Yeah. What about it? So basically, we have an artist here that we have up under us. His name is Chad Chuck. So basically, we're Trump supporters, and you know the thing is going on with the whole Trump thing, and we're going we want to hire some fellas to come out and shoot the music video, basically talking about black, you know, the black that's against us, and really just get us our Trump song going, because you know the YG song that came out, so it's kind of like a response. We need our own shit. Hold up, I'm sorry, you said, signal kind of broke up after you said the part, you said violence against us, and what, what, what was the other thing? So basically, it's Trump. It's a Trump song, and it's for us. We, some of us, were Trump supporters, and we're gonna come together. We're gonna rally together. We just want a video because we already got the song done. So knowing, we knowing this guy, no, he doesn't know who the guy artist is that we were speaking on that right. made the song against Trump. But we need a right. song for Trump now. Right. Hey, that's right. What's your name? It's Chad. Yeah. Okay. Hey, look, I like what I'm here, man. Cause you know what? I, 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 I'm totally for Trump myself and for freedom and, 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 and everything like that. So. Chad, I, do you remember when you got my number? No, no, I, I really don't. This has actually been passed down to me. So, so basically, I mean, we we spoke to some people that are at a different level than we are, um, and we're just we're the higher up. You know, we're we're the ones that are bringing capital to the table, if you know what I mean. Um, a little a little cheddar to the cheese. So we're going to be the ones when it comes to delegating who gets paid what and what they want. So we want to make sure we're speaking to the right person. And the people that were under us, they landed us your number. Well, I t let me let me tell you a little bit about me, Chad. Uh, just just to kind of point you guys a little bit better. I actually uh, re about about a year and some change ago, I was actually in in the in the lane of forming a uh, production and and or, or, or perhaps mainly distribution deal in regards to my own music um, to the tune of. Uh, $3.1 million, $1.5 up front. Now, okay. I'm working with okay. a gentleman who is helping okay. me out. Okay, uh, okay, 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 it's fine. But so basically, he wants to know if we can hire you for the set. You Us knowing about you, we can not give a sh rat's ass? Uh, well, 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 what I was saying was, uh, the, the guy that I, work, that I was working with before. All right. I, I, I he right. turned out to be a kind of a crook, um, and he actually ran off with like thousands of dollars of mine and a bunch of intellectual properties, which was a total shock to me because you know of the skill level that he displayed um, in being able to produce. Now, what I can tell you is this: um, he, though he may no longer be with me, uh, I do have contacts for people who can 
take photos, shoot music videos. So, uh, so, so what you're saying is, is what you so what you're saying is, what you're saying is that you you're a sellout. This is because we brought up Trump. You changed your mind. It's because of Trump that he did that. What you talking about? I knew we you don't want to shoot for us now because we're a Trump supporter. I should never believe that guy. No, I support Trump. What is that? What is what I have? No, to because you said that? you're trying to ship us off to somewhere else, and you're trying to job techie us. No, I'm trying to give you some history about me. I'm what do I need to? What give? Well, like, like listen, excuse. listen, listen. We're not dealing with no poop putt putty paw shit now. So we want to know. We're looking to put these dollars on faces. Okay. Well, let. What I'm saying is, I, I can I can I can help in any capacity. We don't need help. We want it done. So either you can get it done, or you cannot help. You're getting rude with us, and we're calling about your business. Why Why are you upset with us? And we're calling to provide money for your pocket. If you can. Well, I'm just I'm just a little bit confused with what. what if you're what confused, exactly we need business you business to get unconfused because we told you exactly what we wanted, and we want it now. Either you can do it for us, or you can fuck off. So you're looking for a producer. When the last time you fucked someone? When was the last time I fucked someone? Yes. What the? F what does that have to do with anything? Because you're trying to fuck us, and we don't even roll like that, pal. I, dude, I'm just trying to figure out what you want, so I can figure out whether I can provide it. Or not. We don't want to get. Fucked. That's one thing we don't want. Okay, well, what do you want? We want the exchange. The exchange. A okay. fair deal. You get your money, and we get our product. What product do you want? Why are you yelling at us, man? Come on, man. We're Come on, man. You... Is this a fucking prank call or something, dog? It's not. This is my direct number. You can hang up and call back anytime. You can do whatever okay. you... Are you looking for a producer? Are you looking for an artist? What are you looking for? Why are you talking to me like that? That's for you, wrong. Because I'm trying to understand what you need. You're calling me asking for something. I'm trying to understand what you need so I can tell you whether or not I can give it to you. All right, cut the shit. This is what we're going to do. I'm not going to lie to you. Can we set up a meeting tomorrow? We can meet with you at Starbucks tomorrow. Okay, that's fine. It'll have to be uh, after I get up at work at uh, about 4 o'clock. So we can meet up at about 5.30. That's fine. Make, who's all going to come with you? Uh, well, it could be just me. Okay, make sure you bring no weapons, okay? Well, I I have a weapon on me at all times. It's part of my Second Amendment right. I would imagine that Trump supporters should understand that. But hell yeah, just wanted to make sure who you were. No, so but we don't want any weapons around us. We don't. That's one thing. And if we can meet at Starbucks down there at the station, that'd be fine. So we want you not. We don't want you to bring any weapons. That's okay. What, what what Starbucks do you want to meet at? The one in Clemens? The one in Monster? Yeah, that's fine. But can, what are you going to bring your weapon? Am I gonna bring my weapon? And are you driving or are you getting dropped off? What what does any of that have to do with the pertinence of this business transaction? A lot of it, because we're trying to get down to the business we have to meet. So are you getting dropped off? Do you mind if we come pick you up? No, you know, okay. Now, um, look, I'm gonna keep it a whole hundred bands with you right now. I can't even figure out what the fuck you want, and you over here asking me, "Can you pick me up?" And I don't, and, and don't bring my weapon. Nigga, kiss my ass. If you a real businessman, you should have been told me what you wanted and we could have figured it out by now. You trying to meet me across town and waste my fucking time, nigga. Call me back when you got a real deal, all right? That was unprofessional. <laughs> <laughs> Why was he saying nigga? Why? We're, We're all, all white, white here. 